Welcome back to the Red Carpet Ria, your go-to spot for all things hip-hop and more. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you won't miss any of our updates. Today, we're diving deep into a controversy that has stirred up the hip-hop world. Drake's latest track, Taylor May Freestyle, not only targets Kendrick Lamar, but also features AI-generated voices of hip-hop legends Tupac and Snoop Dogg. But here's where it gets tricky. Tupac's estate is not having it. On April 24th, Billboard revealed a cease and desist letter sent to Drake from the legal team representing Tupac's estate. On April 24th, Billboard revealed a cease and desist letter sent to Drake from the legal team representing Tupac's estate. The letter demanded the removal of the track due to unauthorized use of Tupac's likeness and voice created using artificial intelligence. This isn't just about a song, it's a clash over ethical boundaries of AI and music. The estate's letter was crystal clear. They're even considering legal action if Drake doesn't comply. The reaction from the industry has been mixed. While some see it as innovative, others like Tupac's brother Moprim express deep disapproval, particularly about using Tupac to disrespect another artist. Billboard reported that they had access a cease and desist letter sent by an attorney, Howard King, to the Canadian rapper urging him to remove the track. The letter indicates that the estate of the iconic Death Row Records artist will take legal action if the song is not withdrawn within 24 hours of the notice. The letter expresses the estate's deep disappointment over Drake's unauthorized use of Tupac Tupac's voice and persona, calling it a flagrant infringement of legal rights and a severe misuse of Tupac's legacy, whom they regard as one of the greatest hip-hop artists ever. The estate also pointed out that using Tupac's voice against Kendrick Lamar, whom they consider a close ally, was particularly offensive. The communication further mentions the likelihood that Tupac's intellectual property was used to create the artificial intelligence rendition of his voice in the track, which has already garnered over a million streams and significant media attention. The estate warned of severe legal repercussions, including claims for damages unless Drake complies with their demands. According to the controversy, Mo Prem, Tupac's brother, criticized Drake early in the week via TMZ for using the artificial intelligence in such a disrespectful manner. He suggested that Drake should have faced Kendrick Lamar directly rather than using what he referred to as the nuclear option. The track in question was released by Drake, now 37, across various social media platforms last week and makes use of artificial intelligence to feature the voices of both Tupac and Snoop Dogg. The song leverages these iconic voices to pressure Lamar into responding and miss other pop culture references. This development adds to an already heated rivalry, with several artists now involved in the growing feud between Drake and Kendrick Lamar, highlighting the complexities and impacts of using AI in music and entertainment. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exclusive content from the Red Carpet Rio.